Hey, what's going on guys today? I got a new Ubiquiti Bullet camera. I kind of wanted to show you the unboxing and setup process because it's so easy. Um, you can really just do it within minutes. So I'm gonna open up the camera here and I'm gonna take a look and show you how easy it is to set up. So obviously it's not gonna be like super quick to mount it, but so this is just opening the box right here. This is a G5 Bullet dome, or sorry, G5 Bullet camera, not a dome camera. All right, so here's the camera. Literally, we're just going to take it out of the box. We're going to set it over to the side here. Remove the box. I have an Ethernet camera. Sorry. I have an Ethernet cable here. We're going to plug into my um, the jacks on my desk here. So I have it plugged into my switch, the PoE switch. Okay, we're going to literally just plug it in. And now if we go over here to Unify Protect, and you will see... Here in a second, it's going to pop up here in the top corner of Ubiquity of our dashboard of Protect. So as you can see, the camera is booting. You can see the infrared lights on it um, booting up. So normally the process will take a few seconds. Um, I am slowly swapping out my old cameras with Ubiquity cameras just because they're so easy to use. The quality is fantastic and they're just all around a great camera. Um, and yeah, so I mean, really, all of these cameras, you just put these mounts together like this, they just all screw in together. And yeah, it's just an amazing experience. So um, that is that. Uh, the camera seems to still be booting. So actually, maybe it's done now. Um, as you can see, my switch over here, it is port two. Uh, where is it? Port two, right there. That camera's blinking. So. Pretty much any time now, we should see it pop up, on our, pop up on our network. And if we go back here to Unify Network, we can go here. As you can see, we have four cameras, which you won't be able to see these cameras, obviously. But um, here in a second, it should just pop up. Okay, so I'm going to have to blur out a lot of stuff here. I apologize. But here, as you can see, we have a click to adopt button right next to our camera. Literally, click to adopt. It's adopting. And as soon as it adopts, it's going to update the camera. I'm going to point the camera over here just so you can see what it looks like. I'm going to point it towards the ceiling. It is going to update this camera as soon as it adopts it. And after the update, it'll be like completely ready to go. It's really cool. As you can see, it's already showing a live view even while it's updating. If I put my hand in front of it, obviously you can you can see that on the camera. The quality is really good. I'm not sure why it looks, actually I do know why. That's because the film is still on it. And I'm not gonna take that off till I mount the camera. Like the protective film is still on the lens. So that's why it's doing that. But it is um, updating now and it will be ready to go here in just a couple of minutes. So these cameras are really fantastic. The quality is really good on them. Um, there's not another camera vendor I'm even looking at at this point because these Ubiquiti cameras are fantastic. I did want to mention I'm also not sponsored by Ubiquity. I bought this with my own money and yeah, just because I really do enjoy these cameras. So like I said, this is the G5 Bullet. Um, they have G5 domes, G5 flexes. Uh, I have a flex too. The flex is also great. That is the one, if you saw my fiber video, that is the one that is um, mounted in my MDF um, as a security camera in there. So yeah, fantastic quality. Um, I really do enjoy these cameras. Highly recommend them. If you're looking for new cameras, you should check these out. The pricing is pretty good. No monthly fees. They just record right to your um, UDM Pro, which is one of my routers that I have here. So that is nice. They, you can also buy a cloud key is what it's called, and it has a hard drive. Or you can buy an NVR and no monthly fees, which is also why I really enjoy these cameras. There's a lot of cameras like my Ring cameras that I used to have. Um, those cameras require monthly fees, and it's kind of frustrating. So, um, yeah. Uh, one other thing, the local recording is also fantastic on these cameras. Uh, I do enjoy that, that if my internet connection drops, these cameras still record locally to my um, NVR, to my UDM Pro, excuse me. Um, so that's also nice added security, that if my internet does get cut, I do still have security cameras running and recording. That is something that like Nest cameras do not have or Ring cameras do not have. So just really great cameras, highly recommend. Thank you for watching this video. I'm not going to show how I mounted the camera because then that will show off where I'm at the camera. So thank you for watching. Have a great day. I'll see you in the next video.